What are you going to do? Sit around and cry? Listen to me and listen to me very carefully because the most empowering thing that can happen for a person, in my opinion, is the ability to earn self-respect. You earn self-respect by building your discipline. You build your discipline and you earn your freedom. You earn your freedom towards feeling better about yourself. It's a building block. We all need to figure out a way on how we can help heal ourselves. Figure out a way to live through it. Figure out a way to fight another day. Figure out a way to lift through it. But what are you gonna do? Sit around and cry? Because sitting around and crying and sitting around and having a lot of self-pity for yourself is just that. If that's all it's gonna promote. It's not gonna promote you getting better. What I love so much about strength training and what I love so much about this community is that everyone possesses the ability to get stronger. I've never run into one person that doesn't possess the ability to get stronger. We all possess the ability to get stronger. You possess the ability to get stronger. Physically, mentally, mind, body, and spirit. When you go in the gym and you start to train and you start to put up points on the scoreboard, that's what you're training for. That's your why. Is because it's gonna alter your mind, your body, and your spirit. When you start to feel better about your body, your mind starts to work better. When you start to feel more clarity in your mind, it gets easier to make stronger decisions that are gonna benefit you, both mind, body, and spirit. I've never met one person in my entire life that doesn't possess the ability to get better. You can be better than you are today. Today might be your darkest days. Maybe you feel like putting a gun in your mouth, but you don't have to. There's a way out. You can get yourself outside. You can get yourself on a walk. You can figure out a way to get some sunlight. You can figure out a way to start eating a little bit better, be a little bit more mindful of your nutrition, be a little bit more mindful of the things that you put into your body, be a little bit more mindful of the things that you feed yourself on a daily basis. All the way from the social media that you feed yourself, all the way to feeding your mind, body, spirit. I think people are feeding their demons as well as feeding their dreams. It's time to starve off the demons and it's time to feed your dreams. It's time to embrace your fears and follow through with your dreams. Embrace your fears and follow through with your dreams. Truly follow through with them. It's time you get up off your ass and figure out a way to follow through with them. Lift through it. Live through it and lift through it. You control your story. You can be the author of your own story. You get to write it with your own pen, in your own ink, in your own words. Because the thoughts and opinions that are made up of other people don't have to make up who you really are. Take that step. Take that step to get yourself in the gym. It's going to have healing powers that are beyond any RX a doctor will ever give you. The greatest respect you will ever earn is self-respect. The ultimate pat on the back, the greatest pat on the back that you'll ever earn is the one that you give yourself for proving yourself to yourself. Improve yourself for yourself. This message is extremely important to me and I hope you guys understand and I hope you share with people and share with me how you lifted through it. Strength is never a weakness. Weakness is never a strength. Go lift through it.